um, so I opened the hive up. Quick inspection. Did inspection about five days ago. I saw I found what I thought was a play cup. I then looked back at the video and it looked like another three or four cells that I've missed. Potential queen cells. Went back in, knocked them down. So open up now, see if there's any queen cells in there. Make sure these bees aren't getting ready to swarm. <coughs> First off, we'll take a look inside your super. See what's going on in there. What's busy in there? Packed with honey, half capped. Let's take a look at one of the middle frames. See how they're getting on with capping this honey. Completely packed with honey, half capped. Other side, packed with honey, half capped. Give it a couple of weeks. We'll be doing a honey harvest out of that super. Clean the scooter off. Dummy board out. Some frame rests in. Bit more smoke. Full frame of cut brood. Both sides. No signs of any queen cells. Another frame of brood. A bit of drone brood at the top. And a potential queen cell. So let's get knocked down. At this stage, I'm knocking down anything that could even remotely look like a queen cell. And one full frame of cat brood. Both sides. Play cup slash potential queen cell there. It's got to go. The last time where I missed them was here, at the bottom of the frame. So I'm not that down. Another potential one there. Fuby's getting a bit agitated, so a bit of smoke now. More smoke. Try not to get stung in the face again.
full foam brood, get a drone brood at the bottom. And a potential queen cell there, look. Knock that down. That's the only one on there, I believe. Another frame of brood. And this here, queen cell. Knock that down. One there, knock that down. On the other side. On the end, see those? missing the queen cell at this stage. Like the last one is these to swarm. I'm going to requeen them in about a week's time. They will be filming it. So tune in. Nice frame of brood. These two cells down here, I don't think they're queen cells, but they've got to go anyway. So brood. And cap stores. No potential queen cells on there. It's important this stage that we check every frame. If you've got these gaps at the bottom of your frames, it's important you check in there because that's where they hide the queen cells. Cells there. Oh, this is a heavy frame. Capped honey, drone brood. Yeah, I'm happy. But that is just drone brood and not queen cells. Last frame didn't have brood in it last time. And again it hasn't. It's got stores in it. So another quick look through, see if I can find a queen. As I'm putting these frames back in. And for the life of me, I cannot find the queen. When we come to requeen this colony in about a week's time, it's imperative we find that queen to remove her. The problem with this queen is she's a 2019 queen, so she's marked in green, a dark green, so she doesn't really stand out. But we will. So there's two cells that I missed. It's always important. I just put the frames back in, I have another cursory look just to make sure you haven't missed any queen cells. Right, let's get this back together. That's it, so uh, a load of queen cells in there. I definitely want to swarm. Like I say, that, that was a swarm caught last year. So that queen swarmed last year. She's a 2019 queen. 
she probably get superseded. Odds are she'll swarm again. So I'm requeening that colony in about two weeks' time. In the meantime, regular hive inspections, not as any queen cells, a bit of swarm prevention. Um, so, thanks for watching. Hit subscribe, give us a thumbs up. I'll see you next time. Have a good day.